Hello guys, this is Bill and this band Ghana Bowers and back to our dance studies with Agnes Band. It's been a while and um, I've been a bit busy with school stuff. You know, it's my final year and I'm just trying to push things forward and come out with flying colors as usual. Yes, yeah, so today I would like to talk about the aesthetics of dance and the artistic of dance. I know a lot of people know about this, but do not know the right term or how to classify it in both categories. I will be talking about in the in a few minutes. Yes. So when we say the aesthetics of dance, it is looking at the originality of a genre of a particular dance. It's looking at its original value, its movement execution, its costumes, props, set, anything that is required of the dance for it to be authentic. In other words, I would use the term traditional. When I say traditional, I do not mean traditional from the setting of the people where other people classify it as cultural dance. No, I'm using the term traditional in the context of its originality, where the dance is coming from, how the dance is actually performed. You don't take anything out. That is how the dance becomes aesthetically beautiful. So when you are judging dance movement or a dance piece or a dancer, you can judge from two angles, artistically and aesthetically. And that is the main purpose of explaining these two terms to you. So aesthetically, you are not looking at creativity, you are looking at the authenticity of the whole thing about the dance. Now, let's go to artistic. Artistic, you all know, deals with creativity. So it's like, okay, this particular dance, this is how it's being performed. This is the costume you should wear. Artistically, creativity. You decide to out your style. You decide to change the costume. You decide to change the setting of it. So these two categories I have explained now, point out to all judges out there that when you are judging a dance competition, you don't only stand on one point, either on artistically or aesthetically, but you can blend. But in the context or the main theme of the competition or any event or occasion, if you guys are looking forward to judging it aesthetically, then you are looking for the authenticity, movement execution, the value, the intensity of the dance. But if you're looking at creativity, how well the dancer is able to go along with the origin, making it his dance, then we can look at artistically. I hope this was very clear and you all understood. But anyways, if you have questions, suggestions, you can just put it down in my comment section. All right. Thank you guys. Don't forget to follow Ghana Bowlings on Instagram and my YouTube channel to watch more interesting stuff and learn dance education with Agnes Ben. Love you guys.